Hi, my name is Abigail and I am a nurse. I am here to demonstrate to you how to administer lopinavir ritonavir pellets. Pellets are packaged in a capsule and are administered as prescribed by the doctor. Take a clean tablespoon and set it on a plate or on a dish. You can also use a small container or a cup. Put a little food on the spoon. The food should either be semi-solid or liquid such as porridge, yogurt, milk, water, tea or other foods available to you. Remove the number of capsules prescribed by your doctor and place them on a clean surface. Take a capsule, hold it vertically, then twist it in opposite directions while pulling gently to open it. If using semi-solid foods, pour the required amount of pellets on the spoon. Pour some more food onto the spoon to cover the pellets. If you are using liquids, Pour the pellets onto a clean spoon, add a small amount of the liquid on top of the pellets, but do not try to dissolve. Do not let the pellets stay for long in the liquid, as it will become sticky and develop a bad taste. Feed the baby with the food or liquid containing the pellets immediately. Follow up with more food or liquid to ensure that they swallow all the pellets. Repeat until all the capsules are finished. Finally, check the child's mouth to ensure that no pellets remain. It is advisable not to pour large quantities of pellets. Pour about one or two capsules at a time. Make sure that all pellets are on the spoon and that no pellets fall off. For babies who are being breastfed exclusively, Place a little expressed breast milk onto a spoon. Pour a small amount of the pellets on the spoon. Add a little breast milk on top of the pellets, but do not mix or dissolve. Pour the pellets into the baby's mouth and follow up with more breast milk to ensure that the baby swallows all the pellets. Repeat this until all pellets are finished. For all caregivers, make sure you give the pellets with food or beverage that the child prefers to take and will swallow without chewing. If the child is resistant or vomiting, try to administer fewer pellets at a time. Ensure no pellets remain in the mouth as it will develop an unpleasant taste after a short time. Capsules must be opened to administer pellets. They should not be swallowed.